What's good guys, Long Weekend Gang back with another pickup video. Today, our pickup is the newest Bape and Adidas collab. Uh, this is the NMD from the collab. The collab also included another NMD in the green Bape camo, uh, down jacket, and two track jackets in both black and green camo. Uh, if you didn't know, the release for these shoes was actually really, really crazy. The stores got shut down worldwide. Um, all the Adidas stores, the Bape store in Japan got shut down, the Bape store in New York got shut down. So honestly, I don't know how I was able to get this shoe, but I'm really blessed to have been able to get this shoe. Uh, the shoe itself, uh, let's get into details now. There's, on the back tab, you have the bathing ape going down, which is a really cool detail. And then you have some, I believe, Japanese writing, which would make sense because it's Bape. Uh, and then you have the Bape black camo which is very iconic. You have the Adidas three stripes, of course. The bottom is like any other NMD. And something that I thought was really cool is each shoe has the camo on the insole. And on one shoe, there's the Bape logo, and it says a bathing ape, and on the other shoe, it's just the Adidas logo with the camo. Uh, overall, I'd say the quality on the shoe is, I mean, it's just what you'd expect from an NMD. I believe there was only something like 90 pairs of these in this colorway on adidas.ca, so for Canada. So quality is like, it's all right for how limited the shoe was. I think it could have possibly been done a little better. Uh, there is like, the back of the shoe, uh, we'll probably show it in B-roll shots, it's a little bit crooked, which is not something you like to see with a shoe that's this limited. Quality control should have been a lot better. Alright, so I'd say that the shoe itself, uh, especially in this color, the green color is really nice too, but I'd say this colorway in particular is really easy to wear, and for someone like me, I've always really like liked Bape, so it's obviously like a cop for me, but I'll be completely honest with you, I am going to resell this shoe just because the price is way too high for me to justify keeping it. If you weren't able to get this shoe for retail, honestly, you're probably never gonna own this shoe unless you're really, really caking. I'm not I'm not in a position to be keeping a shoe that's worth around a thousand dollars, so I'm gonna let these go. Let me know what you thought about the shoes in the comments. Uh, like the video, share the video with your friends, and now we're just gonna get on to the on-foot section of the video. 